What you guys doing? Um, nothing. Nothing, just playing. <laughs> We're just playing games. Just doing some holes. <laughs> yeah. Breaking some pieces. Why are you drilling holes in there? Um, Is that butter? It's candies. Or parquet. Candies. Candies. <laughs> yeah. So he's he's making a design center and I perforating. So we got a Teflon uh, block. The insulator block. An insulator block. We're gonna put these on our um, we have the we have rods going through the battery box laterally. We had uh, we have copper rods running long long ways. Um, they're gonna rest on top of these as an insulator and then we're gonna wrap the wires up around the copper and we're gonna gonna solder <laughs> the wires on top of the uh, the copper. of these tabs to bend over so that we can connect the batteries together and I made this jig from my kids Legos and it's working quite well and Brett is over there soldering them after I've bent them. Yeah so Kira was playing with uh, our son Lyric's solder or our son Lyric's Lego set and I was like Kira are you gonna help me or what and she's like blah 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 because she was obviously building something extremely functional. She's amazing. She is the one I count on when it comes to building a battery pack. She has that meticulous ability to cut the rubber insulation perfect. Obviously what you're seeing there. So she's doing that as you can see and then once all of these cells are um, arranged how Kira's doing it, I can come in, drop the solder and create a 48 volt pack. We have a really unique way of doing this I feel. it's. Uh, I've got these wires on the end size here so they deliver the one or two amps which is all they're going to deliver um, but if they were to see anything like 20, 30 amps this is a fuse so that's really nice so we have um, built in fuses everywhere so it's an incredibly safe um, lithium pack. Mm -hmm. 